Hey you guys, it's me, Kira T, and I'm back with a quick video. Um, I haven't uploaded in a while, and it's because like so many things have been going on, and like when life shifts, naturally you have to shift with it. Um, and so I haven't been as been able to crank out as many videos, but I am here today with one. And um literally everything has pretty much changed in my life. But the gist of this video is just kind of like a placeholder. And as a re permanent reminder for me um, in regards to leaving this somewhere that, man, like tomorrow really isn't promised. Um, you know, it's the most interesting thing. We can truly plan for so many things and pursue different things in life. And in the blink of an eye, it can all be taken away. You know, people leave their homes to run to the store or to, you know, go somewhere quickly or to go to work and then they just never return. Um, and I just kind of had a subtle reminder of the fact that life isn't promised. Tomorrow isn't promised. Our next moment isn't promised. Our next breath isn't promised. Um, and because that's just so engraved on my heart right now, um, I just wanted to stop and, and, and say that and let that be what I share on today um because it, it's just so real you know like i've i'm guilty of that like i'll make plans and i always do my best to say if it's in god's will if it's god's will if it's the lord's will because i don't ever want to be so boastful that i insinuate that all these great things are about to happen not factoring in the fact that they'll only happen if god has said so you know um i don't know when my last day on this earth is um, and I don't mind leaving it, you know, except I just, I definitely want to live a fulfilled life and I want to be um, a light for the kingdom of God. But um, in saying that, it's like, man, when you really wrap your head around the fact that things just change at the drop of a dime, how many people wake up um, to or receive certain news throughout different points of their days that literally automatically alters the course of their life. You know, I'm just I'm just so grateful to God for um, for the life I've lived. You know, I'll be 33 next month in, in July and um, I'm so grateful. I'm so grateful of the path that my life has been taking, um, the things that God has been doing, the blessings he's bestowed upon me, the people he's placed around me, the boundaries he's allowed me to live contently and comfortably and with peace. Um, and, and, you know, I'm so grateful for all those things. But it's like, man, when you think about the fact that tomorrow isn't promised, it really just makes me want to, you know, get on my book quicker and release that and really get into these um these life coach classes and, and, you know, just the different things that God has um, put in my life in regards to purpose work and also support others, you know, and whatever their endeavors are. There's some small businesses that I'm interested in investing in and whether that be my money or my time. And those are th those are things that are on the table. Um, you know, actually, when I think about it, I'm actually working with multiple people in regards to small businesses. And, um, you know, it's just like, how can I give back? How can I contribute to this thing um, and just use my time effectively? But all that to say, every day is special, man. Make every day count. You know, don't allow one day to go by and be sad and be feeling, you know, the weight of different things. Life life throws us, the enemy throws us so many different curve balls and things of that sort. But it's like, man, we really do have to live every life prosperous and in the abundance that God has promised us. Because tomorrow, oh, tomorrow is not guaranteed. It just isn't. And like I said, I just really wanted to leave this here um, today as a placeholder because, you know, something has something has specifically um, came around and it made me think like, man, we can't be making plans dang near for next week. You know, it's like we can we can be ambitious and truly hope and desire for those things to happen. But it is truly if it is truly only in God's will that those things, though, th that these things will and shall be. So I just wanted to say that as a quick little drop um, in regards to a word of encouragement. I hope everybody is well. I hope that whoever needs to see this video, that they see it, that they receive it. And that even if just for the day, it's a place for you to pick up and start shifting your thoughts and seeing things differently and being grateful for the gift of life. Um, if this is what it's meant to do, I pray that it does that for you. If you watch to the end, thank you. And until next time. Bye.